So what is going on guys, Fly here from Roderick Studios, and today I'm bringing you guys another GTA 5 online update video. Now, if you guys do enjoy this video, go ahead and leave a like down below, it really would help me out, let's get into it. So today, patch 1.12 was released, now it didn't bring all of the features that I've been talking about over the previous weeks and the previous videos, but it did bring some small new things that hopefully will set the groundwork for the future things to come. So I'm going to be showing footage of these new features uh, throughout this video. I know a lot of people were really hoping heists and stuff would come out. They haven't yet, nor have a lot of things that they've promoted. There's they, there's no new apartments yet, but there are just a few small features that they did mention in the changelog, uh, not so much the DLC itself. Believe me, I've definitely checked. So as you're going to see coming up on screen in a minute now, is the new feature which now lets you have the cops turned off for a certain amount of time. So I talked about this in a previous video and it was featured on the newswire on the update list. So here you can see notification give less to recall if you want the cops to ignore any crimes you commit for a short period of time. So I decided to go and try this out on Vinewood Boulevard. So I gave less to recall and at the bottom of the list, surely enough, for five thousand dollars you can have the cops completely turned off for three minutes. Three minutes does seem kind of low for that price but I guess I understand you don't want people to try to abuse it too much. Now, I didn't get to try this too much, I was very pressed for time, uh, I'm very busy today, but apparently you can use this to go and steal a jet, so I didn't get any footage of this, but hopefully this won't be removed, I don't know if Rockstar had this in mind when they implemented it, because this seems like a really easy way to go and steal a jet from Fort Zancudo, and not really see any repercussions from the sand turrets uh, and the other vehicles in the area. So hopefully you guys can go and use that and see how it works. You can see me just blowing up all of these cars here, and there's a timer down in the bottom right, telling me how long I have left while the cops just turn a blind eye, as they call it. Uh, so I'm just going on an absolute rampage here, killing many, many people, blowing up tons of cars, and you're going to see in a minute, once it runs out, the cops instantly come back on. So I fire one RPG round, and next thing you know, the cops are all on you. But I'm really excited to have this feature in the game. I think it's really going to add a lot to, for a lot of filming purposes, maybe, for the videos that I like to make. I feel like that could really help out. You can fire your guns, you can make these little machinima and action-packed kind of videos without having to worry about the cops getting in the way constantly. So, of course, you're limited to only three minutes, but I don't know if there's a cooldown period. I'll definitely keep you guys updated. So here you can see I fired an RPG after the cop time had gone down and you can see I instantly got one star from that. So this next feature I'm showing you in single player but it also works online is that now you can turn the camera grid off while you're using the Snapmatic phone. So you can see here you just by pressing one button on the right bumper you can easily turn the grid off so that you don't have that when you're when you're using it so you don't have to worry about having the grids there. Of course, once you actually upload them to the social club, they're no longer there. But if you want to film anything like that, and then put it in uh, a cinema mode kind of thing, where you have the black bars, then, of course, you have that removed. So that's pretty much all I have for you guys today. If you guys do enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like down below. It really would help me out. And subscribe if you haven't already. This has been Fly from Rodroy Studios. Signing out.